All right, I am doing digging deeper into Leo. All right. So, your most likable trait is exuberance. You are devoted to yourself. All Leos have a territory that um, they call their kingdom, um, like at their home, work, some kind of creative world. Um, or it could be something else. Um, but in that environment, you are the unquestioningly ruler of this kingdom. You are dramatic and everything about you is uh, theatrical. You have um, found the role you, uh, you play in life and you are the monarch of all you survey. You want to be um, noticed every time that you walk into a room. Um, you want to be praised. You want to control things, too. You are witty, vivacious, a fluent talker. Um, you are a born entertainer who can lend spice to any occasion. Your energy is electric, and people gravitate to you as um, still filings to a magnet. Um, you have a flair for drama and an instinct for getting attention. You are a positive person that wants tremendous positivity. You despise negativity, um, the ordinary and dull, when um, you want life to be fancy and creative. Um, when life does not supply the happiness you need, you create your own world. Um, Hyperbole is second nature to you. Um, you want to do things in a really big way. Um, if you invite people to your home, um, um, like if you invite people to your home um, or your castle, as you may call it. Um, you, uh, you entertain them royally. You are a wonderful host. You desire to always be first. Second is not good enough to you. Um, it's like being the first loser. Luxury is vital. You desire the good life and you don't care about the cost. You are not good at bargaining because you want what you need when you want it. Um, public image is very important to you. Even um, when you have no money, you still find a way to go to that expensive restaurant or buy fancy new clothes. Leos are the most lavish spenders. And, like, I've known a few Leo women, and, you know, they um, always seem to have somebody around that would just give them money to, to, to do whatever, you know, they need me. I'm not too sure on Leo men. Um... But I've, I've known a few Leo women who, you know, they weren't even like their boyfriend or anything like that. They were just friends, but they were always, these friends were just like always there to help them out. Um, that's um, kind of like um, how like a Leo man or a Leo man or a woman may pay for things even though that they don't have anything. Is that they just know people who are like, look, I know you like this, you know, go go to that restaurant here here's 50 bucks go have some fun you know and it's 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 the kind of energy that you give off because you're so fun to be around with that they want to they want to keep you happy um nobody likes being around a depressed leo <laughs> um you are generous kind and open-hearted you find it hard to believe ill of others if you are injured um you do strike back quickly but you also forgive easily and never hold a grudge. Um, and on the never hold a grudge part, depending on some other placements and signs, y you might. Um, you are affectionate and cheerful. Um, the sun is your ruler, and you always bring some sunshine into um, other people's lives. Um, you are the sun radiating and bring life-enhancing, radiating, radiating energy and magnetism, um, burning with um, um, stuff.
steady fixity. Um, you are um, eternal children, for you take pleasure from the moment and are uninhibited in giving it, um, affection. You, you don't hold back. You always show yourself. You are a wonderful friend. Um, if approached appropriately, and normally flattery is the right way to approach you, you will uh, do almost anything, but you expect praise and appreciation and admiration in return. Pride is your Achilles heel. Your ego demand, um, your ego d um, does not demand respect but adoration. Um, you don't want compliments but flattery. And when you receive a lavish praise, you never stop to wonder if it is insincere. Despite, um, despite your self-centeredness, you need others to give to, um, if only to get back their appreciation. Um, you often suffer silently from appreciation because you are too proud to ask for it. Your hidden secret is that you need to be needed. Um, in business, um, you are in command because you assume that you were born to be in a high position. Um, you are um, best at creating a positive environment. Um, you want people to be happy and you want the happiness to be the result of what you do to create that atmosphere. Um, you know the value of socializing and you work best in groups. You give and do not take orders. Your positive attitude helps that you do not seem um, authoritative and other people do not mind doing what you say. Um, you also work hard. You will, um, you will also not flinch from confrontation. You stand up for yourself. You will do what scares you because if you don't, then you know you will fail. So you will face your fears head on, but not in a crash dummy type way, just to make that clear. Um, you are ambitious and not ruthless. You also won't be pampered by petty rules. You are not a big fan of routine, for it leads you to depression. You need creativity. You normally do not stay depressed or sad for too long because you have an unshakable belief in your luck and will quickly bounce back from anything. It is difficult to dislike you. You can be bombastic and overbearing at times. You love to give advice and tell people how to run their lives. Um, you can be quite indolent and lazy. You like to sit back and bask in your own glory. But, your great warmth and sunny disposition um, is very hard to resist. The world wouldn't be fun without you. Alright, so I hope you enjoyed that digging deeper into to Leo thing. Um, so I'll be doing a poem next, but... Um, the next part of Leo, I'll be going into your inner self, how you perceive yourself, and how other people will perceive you. And then I'm going to show how you evolve as a sign. Like, what are the steps that you need, or have you already taken the steps? Are you already the best Leo you can be? Alright, well, you guys have fun, be positive, and um, until next time.